Alright my friends, what is up and welcome back to Gary's Mod. Today we'll be taking a look at the Super Hot Weapons Pack. We took a look at a mod quite a while ago in GTA 5 that utilized the Super Hot powers, but I think this one's going to top that because we get the actual weapons and they even come with the abilities pre-installed so I can't wait to see exactly what they do, but I do know that we're able to manipulate time just by moving. As you can see from this object right here, it stops spinning the second we stop. But that's kind of not really the full story because, well, even in Super Hot, when you do stand still, time doesn't really completely stop, it just slows down to a crawl. And that's kind of what happens here. And it even does it in a really nice fashion, just like in the actual game. Being able to utilize pistols, as well as rifles, and we even get the shotgun. So without further ado, my friends, let's take a closer look at this mod in the Super Hot Weapons Pack. What's up, fam? Starting up with the pistols. So we get the Super Hot announcer speaking his lingo that he does in the game. Because that's like the only dialogue in the entire game, I think. But we get the pistol here, which just fire the same bullets, same sound effects and everything. Like, honestly, I'm, I'm really impressed with the detail here. He could have just added basic weapons that shot like... I don't know, the pistol in Half-Life 2 or something, but no, he went all the way and he got the real OG weapons in here, so let's spawn some NPCs and see exactly how well this works. Alright, so even spawning him, it spawns in slow, he has a shotgun, we move, everything's normal, the second we stop though, things slow down. And that gives us immense amount of time to aim up that shot and take the killing blow. There's only one issue with this mod, and it's pretty big, is that it doesn't apply a slowdown effect to the bullets when enemies shoot at you. So let's say we spawn that shotgun guard once again. Hmm, we've slowed down, but when he shoots, it just instantly hits us just like it would in regular Gary's mod. So, in actuality, we really don't gain any benefit from this, other than the fact that, well, we get- Oh, yeah, that happens too. And that was great. Thanks, man. At least I died fabulous. Look at that. Okay, enough of that. What I do want to say is that it's a bit annoying that that doesn't actually happen like it's supposed to in the game. But, I digress. It's still pretty cool that we do get that accuracy by slowing down time. So as long as we do take the shot first, then we should be good to go. And something else I was thinking, guys, is, hmm, what if we can override their weapons with the super hot weapons? Because think about it. Everyone in super hot uses the same super hot weapons. So maybe that was the issue. But as you can see, we cannot override any of their weapons with the super hot weapons. Maybe there's a separate download for that. I'm not quite sure but that is a bit unfortunate. Next up, we have the rifle. And once again, guys, when you run out of ammo, you throw the weapon just like you do, well, like you can do in Super Hot, especially in Super Hot VR, which is really, really satisfying. All right, I spawned some combine. Once again, guys, remember that shooting counts as moving, uh, I think. So that will definitely not be in your favor if you shoot constantly. You wanna really take time to make those precise shots and that's really the fun in super hot is that you get shot once you are dead we don't get that same luxury here but we do get that same accuracy so the machine gun you shoot it once it shoots out a lot of bullets and it's a bit uncontrollable if i have to say like watch this i'll press it i'll click once and you shoot out like three rounds. I don't know why that is. That's kind of interesting. And that guy is the douchebag of the year. Last up, we have the shotgun. And yes, this is going to be a very small video. And, wow. Who put a gas tank there? This mod is already glitching everything. Okay, we'll use the shotgun here. Again, that accuracy is what I'm looking for. Okay, that's... This is getting a little weird. I love this map, by the way, guys, and I almost feel bad for him. Not really. Where's that final dude at? I thought there was one more guy left. The shotgun shoots out a nice spread of bullets. Right click does nothing. R does nothing. You cannot reload these weapons, guys. 
Once they're empty, you just toss it Reaper style. So, nothing you can do about that. Or can you? Because we have an infinite ammo variant of all three of these weapons. This is going to fix that low ammo issue you might have when using these weapons. You guys remember when I used to spawn like a crap ton of NPCs when the video was getting dull because I couldn't find anything else to fill the video with? Yeah, we're bringing that back. Old school Necros video style. And this is going to suck. <laughs> yeah. But I control time with my weaponry, so I'm going to pull out my shotgun and just fire away from up here because I feel safe. So it's pretty cool just being able to manipulate time like that. And the thing I like is that it stays true to the source material. Like, it actually does feel like I'm in super hot right now. Although, it's not really fair because everyone else has, like, lightning fast weapons and I do not. But these weapons have a pretty big radius, so that definitely does work out in my favor. What about falling? Does falling affect it? <gasps> no, it doesn't. Oh, so you can get some really epic moments here. I still have that parkour mod installed from last video, so I can help use that to my advantage here. Slow down when you need to get a breather. There we go. So as long as you're not touching the directional controls, you can do whatever the hell you want. And that's pretty damn sweet. I'm going to go ahead and switch to a rifle. Don't mind me. Oh, and there we are, guys. Shoot quick if I need to. Slow down to catch my breath. This is what Super Hot was all about. Is that it? Is everyone dead? Whoa, no, no. Where's that coming from? Someone is still alive. Maybe he fell through the map. Oh, there. Oh. Oh, hello, guys. What are you guys doing? Oh, it's, it's an air booster. Okay. Well, now they're dead, so they can just float on into infinity. Which, by the way, guys, I love this map. I couldn't find a super hot map, so I just found a cyberpunk, futuristic-looking map, and this one fits it perfectly. And that's pretty much it, guys. There really isn't a whole lot to this mod. Um, it's just a nice little weapon pack, but I thought it definitely did deserve a, a spot on this channel. Because I love the whole premise of how it works. I liked how it does stick to that source material, and it works exactly how you expect it would, but in Gary's mod. And that, of course, will end this video, guys. I want to thank you so much for watching this video. If you did like this video, please leave a like down below and subscribe to see more videos just like this. Also, leave suggestions in the comment section down below or my Discord page in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Until next time, my friends, farewell. Also, big thank you to everyone who stayed to the end, and of course, my patrons on Patreon. Go ahead and click on the left video to see the last video I uploaded, and the video on the right to see the video before that one. As always, guys, you are amazing for supporting this channel, and I'll see you in the next video, guys. Until next time, farewell.